how do you keep track of errors that occur in multiple branches of your code? In Level Core 2, we learn how the Merge Error function can be used to help us perform error handling by linking up multiple code branches. However, the default behavior of the Merge Error function is that it will only propagate the first error that it sees. Here, we have error 7 and error 2, so only error 7 will be propagated. Why do you need to propagate both errors instead? Just right click on the Merge Error function and select Retain All Errors. Notice that the details about both errors now appear in the source string of the error cluster output as a JSON formatted string. So how do you extract these details? We can use a match pattern function to locate the start of the object in the JSON string. Then we use the unflatten from JSON function. The output will be an array of errors where each error is an individual array element. So that's all for now. Do check back here for more tips in our next video.